the design team kind of all converges and drives towards that single purpose of creating the environment and the space for the performer and the audience to thrive simultaneously at the same time. Holographic is one of the ways to present the visuals, but we also have live video and also just animation, but everything we use projection on the screen. The moving set is also able to represent this no boundary concept. The screen and the dancer and the audience and also the shadow of the dancer, they are overlapping with each other. So when the projection is on the screen, sometimes it creates a very interesting illusion. It's like freedom, actually it's always there, but if you do not have the sense or not aware of that, you just don't see it. You just have to catch it. 이 작품에서는 어, 의상의 방향이 무용수들이 무대에서 있을 때 인간의 원초적인 부분까지도 관객들이 상상할 수 있게 어, 의상에서 표현을 하고 싶었고요. 그래서 인간의 신체 구조를 살피고 그 형태를 자유롭게 해체시키고 다시 자유롭게 결합하여 그 과정에서 각기 다른 디자인이 나왔고 그 다른 디자인을 it wasn't so much about lighting the performers, it wasn't so much about an overall arcing concept, but it was more about creating that space that the audience is in simultaneously as the dancers are at the same time. I think the interesting part or the exciting part would be that every day it looks different. The audience becomes a part of the environment, the space that the performer is in. So that heavily affects what every audience sees for every show. Yeah.